Thank you for joining us. Welcome to Vumeo Station. Back to more Pokemon hacked Wi Fi battles on X and Y. I do plan on doing this for Mega Alpha Sapphire, by the way, if it allows me to do so. But as for now, it's on X and Y, and uh, I'm more than happy to, to, to do it for X and Y. But yeah, let's go ahead and get a look at the team. Today, we will be versing my good friend, the Hidden Mo. I've known him for like almost two years now. So when I say good friend, I mean like best friend. You know, he's amazing. But uh, we're going to be versing him. You know, if you don't know who he is, he's known as the Hacks God, and he likes to battle with hacks and Personally, I think his hacks is a lot better in double battles, sort of like when there's four Pokemon in the field. So we're going to be doing a double battle this time around. Uh, you know, I don't have to just stick to single, you know, 1v1 battles. Uh, I can, I'm going to do a double battle versus Mo, just because I feel like that's when his hacks sort of uh, comes out and it shines the best. And it's just, it's just, I don't know, I feel like it just works better in doubles. So I'm going to give Mo that opportunity because, you know, switching out isn't as common in double battles. So I'm going, to, I'm going to help Mo out with that. I'm not going to, you know, 1v1 him because I did it before and he didn't really get much hacks on me. And uh, yeah, it's, I don't know. I, just, I want this to be an actual challenge for him because the Pokemon I have are pretty damn powerful. I tried to sort of venture out of OU. I think the only OU Pokemon I have is Excadrill, which is just a regular Excadrill. He has no sort of hacking done to him. He's just a regular Excadrill. But first of all, we have a Machamp, a super power Machamp. A lot of you guys said suggested I like say hey give him a champ superpower so I was like you know what cool I'll give my champ superpower but close combat's better honestly so why don't I just give him contrary <laughs> so we have a contrary superpower machamp I don't know if this is gonna be too good or what <laughs> it's against Mo so it's like I don't really because he's gonna be hacking me to death anyway so you know it's all luck at the end of the day but this is gonna be fun either way but yeah it's a superpower knockoff stone edge earthquake I originally meant to have bullet punch on it but I, I gender it as bulk up and I'm like well that's terrible especially because he's assault vested and contrary that's like not what I wanted, so I just gave Earthquake uh, from the TM, so it sort of works against me because I do have uh, Ampharos on my team, which is one of the, like, it's like the, it's, this is like the gem on my team, it's like the, it's the main Pokemon, but let's go ahead and move on to see what we have next, like I said, we have Excadrill, which, uh, he's got Aerial Ace, of course, the Choice Scarf Excadrill, and he's got Sand Rush, just because I don't want to give him Mold Breaker, so, you know, if I want to use, I mean, I guess, if I did give him Mold Breaker, uh, I could just use, um, you know, Earth, I could just use Protect with my Rotom, because I have a Rotom W on my team, if you didn't notice. It's another one that all you Pokemon I have. But yeah, I'll give him Sand Rush, because I do know that Mo likes to run uh, this Pokemon called Derude, which is his Tyranitar. So, just in case he brings that, I guess that'll be nice for that. I'm not trying to counter-team him by any sort of means. I don't know if he's bringing that, but it's just like, in case he wants to bring some Sandstorm shenanigans, I have something for it, because I know Mo. I mean, if I didn't know Mo, I don't know if I would give this thing Sand Rush or not. But you know what? Who fucking cares? You know? Let, let's just, <laughs> this thing doesn't have anything hacked on it at all, it's just choice scarfed and it's just, it's just a cool guy at the end of the day. But next up though, we have Eraser, the Porygon 2, with, uh, if you like, I gave it Prankster. So I have Prankster Recover and Prankster Will-O-Wisp, and I also have Ice Beam and Tri-Attack just for coverage, and uh, that's that's pretty much that, he's just a specially defensive guy, but uh, you know, I've got this physically defensive guy here called Rotom, he knows Scald rather than Hydro Pump, you know, so he's got the chance to burn just by doing damage, he has Volt Switch, Pain Split, and Protect, that was actually suggested by a commenter, I don't recall your name. Uh, I might put your comment on the screen if I remember to do so. If I don't, I apologize. I just thank you so much for this this nice idea. Now, I could have went all out and I could have gave him Recover if I wanted to. I could give this Rotom Recover. But no, I was like, you know, Pain Split works fine. Just because I don't want to, like, make my Pokemon too OP to where, like, it's just a horrible battle. But I feel like with this next Pokemon I have... It may be a bit too OP, but we're gonna see how it goes since, you know, this thing has got Follow Me, which Follow Me is a priority move, and uh, I think Pachirisu used it in VGC or something like that. Pretty much what Follow Me does, it just makes every Pokemon attack the Pokemon that's using Follow Me. So, I have this Fur Coat Florges, because it's got Fur Coat you know, on its neck, you know, it makes sense, I guess, to me. And it's a bold nature, so it, just look at its stats, uh, Fur Coat pretty much halves the damage for physical moves, so it pretty much makes it 400 defense, and it's got 400 special defense, so it's insanely bulky, it can take both physical and special moves. That was actually suggested to me by the King Nappy, so thank you to him, but uh, I didn't give it Wish, just because I wanted to be one of those stally assholes, I, like, I gave it Aromatherapy, um, just in case, uh, you know, because I know Mo likes to be, uh, like, a swagger confusion guy, I'm not trying to counter him, I just know him as the hack squad, you know, if you're battling Mo, you know that you're gonna be coming up against some hacks, so, you know, I'm just, I'm being prepared, you know, but I'd rather have Aromatherapy, just because I don't want my, I don't want my Pokemon to be Toxic Salt to death, uh, you know, and Florges is just there to take hits for my Ampharos here, 
my Mega Ampharos that has Cotton Guard and Tail Glow. The whole reason I have Follow Me on it is just so I can set up Cotton Guards and Tail Glows and discharge at will, pretty much. And that's why some of my Pokemon have Protect and a bunch of other stuff like that. So that's pretty much my team. It's not the best made team in the world. It's just for fun, honestly. I'm not trying to be uber competitive. I'm not really that good at doubles, uh, but we're just going to give it a go. I just figured I'd try and do something when it comes to doubles where, you know, I, um... I had a, uh, what's it called? What's it called? Let's go. Let me just type to Mo telling him I'm gonna challenge you in, uh, no, I'm gonna challenge him now. Battle, and, uh, let's go for a two-player match, of course, and it's gonna be a double battle. And, uh, the normal rules are there. Play with Mo Heat. Nope, we're not gonna use the game chat. And we're gonna challenge him now. So... And this is just for fun. That's all the reason why I'm using these hacked Pokemon, just to show them up to you guys. And just so, like, so show, like, cool ideas that we have or, like, that we could come up with. Uh, I don't know. Just, it's just what, like, if this, if Flora just had fur coat, he'd be ridiculous. Because Flora's ability right now isn't, like, it's like a doubles ability or something like that. It's like symbiosis or something. And it's not all that good. It's not amazing by any sort of means. So the, the fact that I gave it fur coat is ridiculous. But uh, I think I want to... Do I want to start off with Ampharos and start sweeping straight away? Or do I want to Do I want to just... I don't know what to start off with. So we're going to go ahead and get into the battle with Mo. I Now I rem I'm remembering... Take a picture of their team because that was almost a problem last time. Okay, so he does have some OU power. I told him. I was like, Mo, please bring a bunch of OU power. You're going to need it against what I've got. Just I, I told him to please have no mercy on me so yeah it's versus mo and uh, i'm gonna go ahead and open up his team in the other monitor and uh, we'll get into this both of us have a john cena on our team and that's the only duplicate pokemon we have he did garchomp, chomp so that was a nice little mini prediction on my part i figured he'd bring garchomp that garchomp knows sandstorm which of course gurin could make good use of that i kind of wish i made it sand force now since i'm scarfed but i originally even met i actually originally meant to gen it as mold breaker and i was gonna go change it because you know i'm i don't pay attention to much things when i'm genning my pokemon i just Go, go fast. Uh, I meant to gen it as a uh, mold breaker, but apparently I gave it sand rush and I'm like, shit, I can't be bothered genning it again. So I just left it. The same with my uh, bulk up Machamp. I accidentally gave it bulk ups. I just replaced it with um, Earth Earthquake rather than Bullet Punch. But either way, we need to actually get into this. I need to think. Should I lead off with Harpo and Laxis? I think I will. I really want to just start sweeping. Uh, I don't think he has anything that can stop me other than Garchomp. Which, if I'm like plus... Yeah, I can sweep Mo with my... Um, with my laxes, so let's go ahead and get to this. Now, I didn't change the music, my bad there. I can't remember everything, you know, my memory is pretty crap, but uh, I'm gonna say good luck, have fun. This is, again is just for the fun at the end of the day. If I sweep Mo with an Ampharos, that'll be hilarious. I originally was gonna give Ampharos Draco Meteor, but then I thought to myself, that that's sort of like working against myself because I, I'm, I'm gonna, you know, I'm setting up my special attack and I'm just gonna be tearing it down with Draco, so like, what's the point? But we are leading off with Laxis here and our Harpo. Now, what I wanna do is, of course, wanna go for a Tail Globe. I think setting up Con Guard is more important because I'm a Calm Ampharos with max HP, max special defense, so I can take special hits equally as decent-ish, sort of, kinda. So I wanna set up a Con Guard, which Ampharos can legit get, but Tail Globe he can legitimately get. I just took inspiration from that, from uh, Pokemon Blaze Black Full Weight 2. I know there's an Ampharos with Tail Glow in that if you watched Nappy and I's LP, you should know that, but let's go for the follow me on the floor just and let Flora just take anything that he needs to take. He said same. Alright, this is like his favorite word. So there we go. Mega Ampharos is here. I really like shiny Mega Ampharos. It's so cool. And I sent Laxus after the guy from Fairy Devil. We have Mole Breaker Ampharos. Now, oh wait, what the? Are you kidding me, Mo? He has follow me as well? God damn. <laughs> Not bad, nice and same tactic. Okay, so uh, Lucy's gonna go for Swagger on the uh, fucking Florges, which I knew was gonna be a problem. That could be a problem in me setting up. So, like, that's why I'm bringing all this power up against Mo, because I'm like, uh, if, if I'm gonna go up against Mo, I know that, you know, him being, you know, doing hacks and stuff could be a problem for my Florges. It might not break through, and then I'm gonna get bopped. You know, my, my, my Laxis is gonna get hurt. So, I knew that could be a problem. Uh, which is terrible, but I want to start seeing up tail glows now. Hopefully my floor just can come through here with follow me This just reminds me of VGC with all the hacks that goes on in there uh, I, have, I don't really play VGC at all. I really want to get into it though But uh, I think I'll save that for Oras right now I just want to have fun hacking X and Y and just going wild with it and just having a, just having fun with it I'm having a blast right now <laughs> No pun intended. Hopefully I get to use all the Pokemon on my team because I don't think I got to do that last time But Mo's gonna go and withdraw his Togekiss and uh, he's probably gonna bring in Derude. Yep, here he is I knew you, I actually didn't know he'd do that, but I knew you'd try and send that in, but Floor just come through, I mean, yes, Floor just, yes, follow me again, good, 
Alright, good. Keep following me. So, the he's going for a Thunder Wave on... Yeah, he can't even... Okay, so he's going to attack me either. Okay, because he can't Thunder Wave a Ampharos, so that's fine. Let me just set up a Tail Glow real quick, though. <laughs> so, I guess his idea is if he uses Earthquake, it hits everyone. I didn't really think about that, actually. Ooh. Does it actually hit everyone, or does it just hit the floor? Does I don't recall. Either way, I'm going to go for a Dragon Pulse here onto Rudy. I don't think we're going to get one shot by any sort of means. Um... I could go for the aromatherapy here. Uh, I could go for a file follow me. Uh, I think I'm just going to go for follow me and try it out. I don't expect to break through this parafusion by any sort of means, but if we do, that's awesome. And we hurt ourselves in confusion. That sucks. We just need to hope that Ampharos can bulk out an earthquake. He's going for a swagger. On the fucking Ampharos. God damn it, Mo. See, all he does, his strategy is relying on luck. It's fucking... Uh, it's Mo. It's Mo. It's Mo. It's Mo. I told you guys that... Oh, he does He does go for the Sandstorm, so that's where Excadrill comes in. But I did tell you guys that uh, that's his strategy. You know, he, he just relies on hacks. We need Ampharos. Pull through, Ampharos. Yes! Fuck. Thank you. Ampharos, you're beautiful. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. He, okay, I was just checking to see if he said anything, but he doesn't really type when he's battling. So that's a dead Rude. Got the Sandstorm up for no reason. Actually, no, he got a Sandstorm up and he's got Sand Veil or something like that. So uh, that is possible for him to not hit, which I know all these strategies are technically Uber strategies and I could technically take Uber Pokemon, but just for his movesets and stuff, all he does is rely on hacks and all it is is just like... It's not really strategy at all, it's just, it's just, you know, you know what I mean. But he brings in Alakazam here, which of course is his, uh, Espeon. Now this thing obviously has magic bounce. Uh, I just want to go for a discharge here and hit everything on the field. And then I want to go for a protect with my Florges, just so I don't kill my Florges off like that. Florges come through. Florges, you want to come through for me, buddy? You want to come through? Want to come through? It doesn't come through. God damn it, Florges, you're probably going to die here, to be honest with you. You know, that's fine. It's going for a tract. Fuck. See, that's why we needed Floor just to come through. So he's he's just gonna start aiming for the fucking Laxus. That's why I that's the exact reason why I gave this motherfucking uh Floor just fo follow me just because I knew he would attack the hell out of this Laxus, but we're gonna break through both of them Get the discharge off now. He's not gonna have uh, Synchronize so that's gonna be dead on both of them, right? Yep, Alex I'm fainted get wrecked get shrecked mate get shrecked, but did floor just take that did floor just really take a plus three discharge? Holy shit. Yeah, floor just took it. Look at floor just not bad uh, So now we're out of our feelings. I'm pretty sure now we're out of our feelings, we're no longer thirsty. This Ampharos is putting in the be the finest of our- I don't think Mo has anything else for it. I really don't think Mo has anything else for this Ampharos. His Garchomp's gone, that was the only thing that he had for it. He decided to set up a Sandstorm rather than fucking attack me. This Charizard doesn't have Flamethrower, I know that for a fact, all it does is go for Air Slash. Ah, I feel so bad, man, I feel so bad. <laughs> well, uh, what do I want to do, what do I want to do, what do I want to do? Hmm. I could just go for another discharge and just end this here. I could, I could, I could. I could do that, I could do that, but I could make it a bit fun. Funner, fun, 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 funner. Uh, I think I might go for another cotton guard just to make sure I'm maximum bulky. That's what I want to do. Let's get another cotton guard up. And then I want to go for, uh, I don't know, I think I'll just go for aromatherapy just to, just to get any sort of status inflictments off. But I know this Charizard here. It is gonna be stupid. Please don't hurt me. It's gonna it's gonna get rid of the sandstorm though. So that kinda sucks for him. Uh because uh you know I was getting hurt by the sandstorm, but now I'm not anymore. So he's going for a swagger. There's the swagger. On my Ampharos, of course. <sighs> he just wants to see me die. Laxus is already confused. Charlo's gonna go for an attract. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna break out anytime soon. I don't think I'm going to break out anytime soon. If I'm thirsty as fuck and I just keep hurting myself, then... God damn. But let's see if the Hacks God can can do things. Okay, there we go. Hurt myself. Not bad. That's why I maxed myself out in attack, except not really. But there we go. Aromatherapy. I don't know if that actually gets rid of your confusion or not. Or if it gets rid of your thirstiness or not. I've got no idea. But, uh, Harpo was cured of, cured of paralysis. I think that's all it did. Okay, so we're cured of paralysis, which is nice, I guess. Uh, I guess that just means I can get a, um... What's called a moon blast off on someone if I really want to. If I really, 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 really want to. If I want to, I want to go for a. T uh, I kind of want to conquer just so I don't get hurt by Swagger that much, but I feel like I'm just wasting time and I should just discharge, but. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. We shall see, sir. I'm just gonna get Moonblast off on this Lucy here, because Lucy is being a little bit of a pest. I shouldn't let this thing just live. He's gonna offer a fucking swagger on me again. God damn it, Mo. God damn it, Mohit! 
So this Charizard is probably just gonna start air slashing the shit out of me. Yep, there we go. There's the air slash. He's starting to get flinches, fucking confusions, and a bunch of other shit like that. Uh, I think I might break out a confusion on my other Pokemon here, but oh, okay, we get the Moonblast off, which is resisted against both of his Pokemon, so it doesn't matter what I use it on, because they're gonna eat it up either way. Oh my god, that actually did a lot more damage than I thought it would. Lord's special attack, which doesn't even matter because it's just a Klefki. Alaxis snapped out of confusion. Okay, you're gonna hurt yourself. It's immobilized by love. And I actually chose just charge that turn. I'm just kidding. You can see the bomb screen. I think I'm just gonna go for a discharge next, though. I think I'm just wasting my time trying to set up even more. I think my Loxus is just gonna, just gonna finish up. He's just gonna, he's gonna finish it up. Let's discharge, and I'll we'll see how it goes. But I really need this Lucy gone. Should I keep Harpo around though, just just for like? Yeah, I think I'll keep Harpo around. But what's he gonna do? That's my question. Harpo could be useful. Two special attackers in the field. Let's go into Eraser. My prankster Porygon too. My prankster Porygon too. I didn't come into this battle expecting to lose by any sort of means. Lucy's paralyzed. Ah, that sucks for him. Swagger. Charla's going for Swagger again on my Ampharos because... Why TF not? Why the fuck not? I just realized I just sent in my Porygon too and I used Discharge. Welp. That is a fuck up on my part if you break through. If you break through, please don't break through. I kind of don't want you to break through. God. Okay. Good. 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 Good, good boy. You, you've not been able to do anything for the past couple turns. You know what? That's fine though. Because while Porygon 2 is you, I kind of want to set up. Uh, so let's call on guard then. Um... So, I don't know why I sent this thing out, just because I'm specially bulky. I'm just going to go for a try attack on this Charizard here, try and get some hacks of my own. He's going for, oh yeah, of course, he got fucking done away. This is so fucking ridiculous. That's why I kept Harpo, just for all this fucking hacks, this ridiculousness. And Charla, Eraser avoided the attack, powerful Eraser, ducking and weaving and shit. Have a try attack, Charizard. It's going to do no damage and probably going to hurt yourself. Oh, you're not going to hurt yourself. Are you thirsty? You're thirsty. You're not thirsty, so we're going for another con card. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Just, just give me all my defenses. Defense draws drastically. So that means my defense is maxed out. That That's what that means. My defense is maxed out. <laughs> so now I'm going to go for a tail glow. I just don't want to attack while a razor's on the field. Feel, field. Feels. While a razor's on the fields. Do, do, do. Well, predicting him to go for a Thunder Wave of me as well. Oh, yeah, he already did Thunder Wave me, though. I'm just gonna go into my, uh, I shouldn't, why, why did I do that? I'm just playing terribly right now, god damn it. Alright, so we're gonna go into 301 plus. Yeah, that's I'm asked. Okay, Lucy is paralyzed. It sucks for Mo. he's getting hacks against himself. He's going for an Air Slash on Laxus. You know what, that's fine. Actually, that did a lot more than I thought it would. Holy crap, he flinched! And the sunlight faded. That's fine, because he doesn't even make use of the sun. Uh, but here we have Rotom. Scrotom. I don't know if Moe's gonna appreciate that. Uh, he has Togekiss left, I know that for a fact. I really wanna get a Tail Glow up though. I really wanna get a Tail Glow up though. Actually, I could just protect and discharge. You know what, I'm gonna Volt's Way. I wanna Scald. I just wanna see how Moe feels about Scald and his Charla. How do you feel about Scald and your Charla, Mo? How do you feel? He's gonna first Swagger, of course. Yep, here, we, here we go, this is no f- <laughs> This is most strategy. This is most strategy to win, and most of the time, it doesn't seem to work out for him. He's going for an air slash and locks us again. No flinch zone. Please, no flinches. Okay. The, the, the hack scald is at work here. Have a scald, sir. How does that make you feel? Scald, Rotom, Wash. We can't burn him, so that's fine. And Lox is flinched and couldn't move! He's getting flinches on me! Fucking Charizard is getting flinches on me. And Lucy's over there getting health back like the little bitch it is. Alright. Well, uh, I'm just gonna have to discharge and protect. <laughs> I'm gonna have to just finally get some last minute damage off with my fucking uh, Loxus. There we go, get the protect off. Good Rotom. God damn it. Fuck this fucking Charla. He's gonna go for another air slash. I swear to god, if I'm flinched on a dumb shit like that, I'm gonna be so fucking pissed. Alright, I'm confused. Of course I'm confused. Why not, right? And I'm thirsty. There's so much fucking shit. This is the downside about setting up against Mo, because he just fucking hacks the shit out of you. God damn it. Okay, so I think Laxus is officially dead. I don't want to fucking... I don't have to Dragon Pulse the Charizard. I can't discharge because I don't want to hurt my Rotom, because it's a physical defensive Rotom, not spicy defensive Rotom. So I'm going to scald the fuck out of this Lucy here. And, uh, fuck. Laxus is definitely dead there, though. Laxus is definitely dead. He took me out by flinching me and making me thirsty, and... It did work, though, Amphoros. You did work. You took out two Pokémon, an almighty two Pokémon. 
<sighs> okay, well, I really want that fucking, uh, what's this fit? God damn it! Not bad, nice and hacks. See, I told you his hacks shines when it comes to double battles. This is where his hacks really does shine. So there we go, foul play, and, uh, okay, okay, we're, we're looking good. We're looking, we're looking decent. We're taking hits because we're physically defensive. Rotom with Scald. I, I think Scald could have killed before, but now not so much because it's got too much ha too much health back. Um, but since we're not Mold Breaker X Girl, we can come in here and Earthquake. And since we're Scarfed and stuff, that's looking nice and powerful. Um, usually I'd be scared to come in against this thing, but I know that fucking Charizard doesn't have... Uh, what's his face? I'm gonna Volt Switch out on the Charizard though. I'm gonna Volt Switch out on the Charizard though. Probably not my best play. Probably should have scalded it now that I think about it. Lucy's gonna go for a Swagger. Ah, oh, balls. See, this, this I should have killed this Klefki years ago. This thing is is nothing but a pain in the ass. So Maxwell's probably gonna end up committing Sudoku or something. Charla's gonna go for an Attract. And of course it has to be on the Exit Row because 301 has no gender. They have feelings too, you know. Genderless Pokemon have feelings too. Break through Excadrill, come through Excadrill, KILL IT! Thank you! I've got Levitate, which is good, so no more breaking shit for you. And then just kill that dumbass Klefki. Get the fuck out of here. Fuck that Klefki. So, uh, after that... Uh, that's, uh, yeah, okay, well, that's Klefki gone, which is good. I'm gonna get the Volt Switch off on the Charizard, so just kill two Pokemon. Uh, so all he has left is John Cena and Togekiss. Which... Um, should I bring in my own John Cena? I don't think I can bring in my own John Cena, that's the thing. Ah, we're actually kind of in a predicament right now. Alright, well, I need to go into Harpo so I can get the paralysis off of my Porygon, because my Porygon's gonna suffer because of that. So let's bring in Harpo, uh, for just last minute, um, you know, fucking, um, aromatherapying. Uh, but we do have a Scarf Excadrill here. Uh, as much as I love to go for the Earthquake, I need to get the aromatherapy off, and mm, actually... Florges is physically bulky this time, so I think it might be able to take a Scarf Earthquake. Do I want to risk that though? That's a thing. We'll just see. Let's just go for the Earthquake, and then aromatherapy, and... Then I'll get a free switch in if I kill... Uh, if someone kills off the... Uh, fucking... Okay, Gurren snapped out. Okay, we're just gonna Earthquake. Please take this, uh, Florges. Please take that. Please take that, you bulky motherfucker. He ate it! Thank you! He's going for the air slash on the extra drill. Good man. Thank you very much, Mohit. Mohit! Go for the aromatherapy. Get that paralysis off my buddy, uh, Porygon, because I really want Porygon to. Actually, no, he's got fucking. What am I thinking? He has a Machamp. Now, John Cena's going kind to of go for an attract, which is pointless in the Florges because Florges was just death water anyway. But uh, that's fine, Mo. You can you can do that if you want. You can you can do that if you want. But that earthquake did so much work to John Cena. Jesus fucking Christ. Um, I'm pretty sure I win this game no matter what. So I'm gonna go ahead and switch out Gurren real quick because uh, I do not need. I need I need to keep him for Iron Head on the Togekiss. But uh, I guess all I can do right now is just go for a. Uh, Moonblast on the John Cena, try and finish him up, unless he has Bullet Punch. Uh, you know, if I don't get it off, that's fine, I don't really mind, you know, 301, 301, have an Air Slash, thank you very much, let me eat that up, let me eat that up, okay, we ate that, we ate that, delicious. So let's see, Flora, does you want to come through? Doesn't want to come through, god damn it, he's going for a Dynamic Punch on the 301, eat that. Physically defensive Rotom for the win, but he does get the fucking confusion off, okay, so we're in a predicament, right, we're actually, we, we're actually looking pretty terrible right now, fuck. Um, yeah, we're not looking too good. We're not looking, we're not looking good at all. Kind of wish I gave wish to this floor just now. Nah, no, 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 we're good. Fuck. What do I want to do? What do I want to do? What do I want to do? I want to pain split on the Togekiss if I can get that off. That'd be fucking wonderful. I really just want this floor just to die. If I can, I don't really, I'm not going to sack it off. You know, I'm not going to kill it myself. I'm just going to Moonblast the John Cena. And of course we're ourselves in confusion. But since we're so physically bulky, we can take it. Togekiss goes for the air slash. Finishes off 301. And that sucks because we needed him sort of, kind of, ish. Little tiny bit, but... A uh, good thing we got Gurren out of there before John Cena fucking dynamic punched the shit out of him. And of course, we're immobilized. He's going for the Thunder Punch. And that's two of my Pokemon down. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. I'm pretty sure that means we're now three to two on him. Okay. Mo's actually coming back. I see you, Big Mo. Well, we are Assault Vested John Cena. <laughs> we are Assault Vested John Cena. We are Assault Vested John Cena. Uh, and we're Scarf Excadrill. So, we should be fine. 
We should be fine. Yeah, we should be fine. Scarf X Girl can Iron Head the fuck out of Togekiss. And then John Cena can kill John Cena. <laughs> Alright, let's get it. I like how fucking Machamp's Cry sounds like Slow Bros, but just altered. So we're going over the Iron Head on the Togekiss. I don't know if it's going to one-shot any sort of means, but let's show off that superpower. Let's superpower the hell out of this John Cena. We are assault vested, though, just because, you know, just want to get my special bulk up. Go for the Iron Head, catch a bunch of Iron Heads, Mo, and oh my god, he lived. Okay, okay, well, he's going for the Air Slash, of course, on Gurren. Yes, he's just trying to do some last-minute damage or something. I don't know. I don't know why he didn't. Oh wait, there's a dynamic punch. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. John Cena didn't appreciate John Cena's dynamic punch. And it's, it's the battle of the gods right now. Can I get superpower off? I can get superpower off. So they go contrary John Cena. This shit's gonna be fucking hilarious. Now this is where bullet punch would be nice because I can just finish off, uh, you know, with fucking... <laughs> <laughs> on the uh, Togekiss, but the superpower Pokemon finally has superpower. But yeah, I just want to say that is the game there. Uh, that was a fun little match, you know? It's not about winning. You know, Mo definitely could have uh, probably played a bit better. I'm, I'm kidding. Mo played fine. Uh, I don't know, it's not about winning to me. I just want to have fun with these hack Pokemon. And uh, we ended up getting a win in the progress, so that's cool. But uh, I, I tried to make a sort of doubles-ish sort of team, you know, it didn't really work out perfectly, but it, in the end we got the win, so it's, it's not a huge deal. But then anyway, again, we are battling Mo. If we battled someone that was playing legitimately seriously, it might be a different story. I feel like my Pokemon might have been too OP. But I don't know. So uh, someone actually did suggest in the comments, like, hey Callum, why don't you be a bit fairer? You know, if you're using, if it's an OU battle, you can use UU Pokemon with hacked stuff and, you know, so on and so forth. So I think I may do that. I may use like one or two OU Pokemon in the team as well, because I kind of just sort of have UU. Like, like um, for RU, I could have NU Pokemon with hacked stuff. And I don't know, that could be a thing. But uh, as for now, I want to go ahead and say thank you, Mo, for the battle. I appreciate it. And, uh, Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Be sure to go ahead and leave more suggestions down in the comments below if that's if you if you want to do that because uh, you know I'll pick them up and I'll try and credit you. I'll put up, like a picture of your comment somewhere in the screen if I remember to. And uh, it's just it's just gonna be a lot of fun. So you know, let me know what you want to see for next time. Let me know if you like what type of battle. You know, single battle, double battle, triple battle. You know, against who? You know, I might try and pick up another YouTuber. You know, I'm actually thinking about uh, picking up Sleepy Jirachi and Shady Shady Penguin. Uh, he also has the same hacking device stuff I have. So you know, we could both go at it with hacked Pokemon. So it'll just be a nice, fun little thing. Either way, that was hack hack. God versus Hacks God, if you want to when you want to call me a Hack God, even though other people have this program, but uh, I guess I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thanks for watching. I'm out.